Baseball season's underway. Well, you better get ready for a brand new day. Hey, Chicago, what do you say? The Cubs are going to win today. And they're singing, Go Cubs, go! Go Cubs, go! Hey, Chicago, what do you say? The Cubs are going to win today. Woo! Sean, let's go, right, baby! All right, all right, y'all won. Go yes. Cubs, go! Oh, God. I oh, have to hear that the whole way home now. Guys, what is up? We just got out of the game. Uh. Rangers versus the Cubbies opening day, and we kicked that ass. Yeah, it was a, it was an ass whooping. Uh, that was bad. That was bad, guys. That okay. looked good. Yeah, I mean, Javier Baez just went off. He says, put me in that MVP race already. How many home runs did he have? Two home runs today. One was a solo, and the other was a three-run homer. Four RBIs to start off the season. Yep. Wow. Absolutely. What a, what a start for a guy. Chris, give him that. Chris Bryant, he had a home run as well. Yes. I think he yep. had a two-run home run. Yep. In so, the eighth. Uh, yeah. Hayward, he was phenomenal too. Jason Hayward, yeah, uh, he made some great plays. Uh, uh, he was defensively, he made some yeah. great plays too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. And you know, y'all's bullpen is trash. Well, so <laughs> that's nothing new. The past years has always been trash. So <laughs> who who is your starting pitcher again? It was Minor. Minor, he went out. Here comes Chavez. The you know Chavez comes steps up to the mound, <laughs> and on the, the first pitch to Javier Baez, it was knocked out. It was Out of here! Three run blast. And then here comes Gomez. He gets m demolished. Yeah, Gomez didn't do anything. And then, and then we bring in Bird. a Bird, who's never played in the major leagues. Mm -hmm. And his first at bat was against R Rizzo. Rizzo, yep. And we're like, and literally we we're like, him. fuck. He walked him, right? Yeah, we had some old people in front of us. They're like, yeah, that's not a good start for him. Because I was like, oh, he's fucked. I said it real loud. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I thought she was gonna turn around and say, calm down, sir. Yeah, and then uh, and then Sean Kelly came in. Yeah. And then after that was fuck. Who else was? I mean, we went. I don't through, care. I think I, we went through the entire bullpen. I you guys were trash. I did not care after that. I was like, fuck my life. Good job by John Lester today getting that win. But mouth breather. Yeah. The Cubbies absolutely looking yeah. dominant right now. They look good. Man, this team could just stay healthy. Good luck to the rest of the National League. Yeah, it was a rough day for my Rangers. American League, don't watch out because we suck. Uh, yeah, it was, I should have known from the get go yeah. with how how the shit show it was just getting into the stadium. Mm. I should have known it was going to be a bad day. Okay, so yeah, about that. When we showed up to the game, first off, we were late, yeah. and that's my fault. I shouldn't. I, I worked the night before. I woke up at one p.m. And the game starts at 3.05. I should not not have even went to sleep, and we should have just left earlier. Because by the time we got here, it was jam-packed. There was still a long line yep. all around the stadium to get into the game after the game started. How is that possible? The, I've never seen that. The line and was it, out to the street. Yeah, people that were uh, that you know that are regulars here that come to opening days a lot yeah. or come to Rangers games, season ticket holders, they were saying they've never seen it like this. No, never. And I've been I've been to a few Rangers games. Now, I've never seen it like you that. had a theory that it was possibly like that because of. Uh, apparently, I saw that they started selling stand standing only seats like they I do at Cowboy Stadiums. I've, I've never, never seen, that seen that before. I've been to this part, ballpark before, and that was yeah. never an option. I saw I, w I came here. Last year, and I didn't but, see that option. Yeah, I think a lot of stadiums are going to start doing that because it's, it's just extra a, revenue. Yeah, making extra money, and it's still allowing people to come, stand <laughs> up, and drink beer. Yeah. <laughs> so, who cares? but we finally got into the stadium, yeah. right? And I had to eat because I haven't ate all day, all night, oh. whatever. So we get into this concession stand near yeah. our seats, yeah. and my God, we were there for so long. Oh God, we were in this line, <laughs> and the fucking chick that was working the register kept. Bitching and complaining. I'm going home. Fuck this. I'm going. <laughs> she said, "Fuck this job. I want to go home." And that line that was, was so long. There was only like first. There was only like a few people ahead of us, yeah. and we were there for like what? Sure. Almost half an hour. I swear, it's half an hour. The funny thing is, both the lines next to us were going fast. We were the only lines that was stuck, and we're like, well, "What can the I guy, do?" The guy, the guy behind you said, "We yeah. chose the wrong line." We chose the wrong fucking line. And then man. when we got. Finally got uh, our order in and everything. I said, let me get a Dr. Pepper because, boy, I love me some Dr. Pepper. The Dr. Pepper was out. <laughs> I'm, I'm like, give me a Coke. <laughs> and then she went and tried, and she heard him. And then she went and tried another Dr. Pepper. And I said, another, give like, me a Coke. 
Because we, at this point, we were like, let's get the fuck out of here. Let's go sit down. And she goes, did you want a Coke? God. And Sean's just laughing because he knows. I, <laughs> he knows I'm, I'm about to go a gasket, I was laughing because I knew exactly what Josh was going to react to. This, how he's gonna, what he's going to say uh, later on. And, and, and there was this fucking guy who wanted a bratwurst, right? He kept asking a billion questions. Yeah, so the, the bratwurst, how are they prepared? And, and, and what exactly is inside the bratwurst? Like, uh, like, is it frozen? Like, is it pre-frozen? What do we think? <laughs> uh, you know what? It's taking a little bit too long. I, as we're ordering, he fucking jumps ahead. He goes, you know what? It's taking a little bit too long, so let me just get, like, three cheeseburgers. And I was looking at Sean. I'm like, this motherfucker better back the fuck off Dude, we're now. literally in the middle of our fucking order, and he just cuts us off. Like, yeah. Get out of here, dude. And then she and then she complains again. She's like, fuck this job. I want to fucking... I'm going home. Fuck this. I'm quitting. I, I would, I would <laughs> never work in the session stand at the stadium. Never. Finally got our food. Finally got our drinks. We head, We sit down. And, oh, man. Things are looking great for Sean. Hey, Elvis Andrews hit a two-run homer, Woo! baby. He looked good. I was like, yeah. And I'm like, don't worry about it. The Chicago Cubs, <sighs> we going to come back right now. And, boy, did we. We blew things off in the... Fifth inning. That's when uh, things really started taking yeah. off. Well, y'all got a solo home run in, in the, the fourth. fourth. That was Javi. Javi. And then y'all just went off in the fifth. Y'all yeah. got six runs. Yeah, it was ridiculous, in man. The fifth, yeah. There was a ton of Cubs fans here at the ballpark Especially in Arlington. Globe sat. Life was nothing but Cubs fans. And every oh. time the Cubs did anything great, you hear a bunch of Cubs fans cheering and everything. It was absolutely fantastic. We got some was, go Cubs, go chants. I was getting so pissed. It was amazing. I was like, ah. They started singing during the seventh inning stretch. They started singing Take Me Out to the Ball Game, which is a seventh inning tradition yeah. at Wrigley Field. Yep. And they said, root, root, root for it. And you, all you hear is the Cubbies. It was amazing. I was ready to leave about about the seventh inning, yep. uh, but we don't do that. We had to stick it through because uh, it was hey, a, we saw Nomar Mazzara th hit a two run homer in the finale, yeah. so that was like cool. I, he's one of my favorite players right now. So, but all in all, fuck. This was our very first opening, opening day, opening day for both yeah. of us yeah. to see our teams, yeah, that was cool. and it was a beautiful day outside. Yeah, and I had a lot of fun. I wonder why. I had a, I had a ton of fun. Now, the weather was perfect. It was about 70, mid-70s. Wind was blowing. It felt perfect outside. Right. And uh, the Cubs and Rangers are having a three-game series. Yes. Today was game one. Game two will be on Saturday. You, yeah. Darvish, will be starting for us. Yep. And then game three will be Sunday. And depending on when the Elite Eight games are taking place, we might try to stream that Cubs and Rangers. Yeah, game. we'll have to take a look. At Who knows? City. Maybe it might be, uh, you know, for the series. Yeah. If y'all were to win on Sunday, Saturday, we will. It's you, Darvish. We know you. Oh, Darvish. you, Darvish, are gonna crush y'all. Hell no, we know you like the back of our hands. He was one. We traded them to y'all. But anyway, so guys, let us know in the comment section down below about your teams and yeah. your opening day experience. Did you have a good time? Did you have a bad time? I know some teams out there did some great jobs. The uh, <laughs> shout out to the uh, uh, no, I don't know. Shout Show some love to the Props. to the Dodgers. They did phenomenal. Set an opening day record with eight home runs. Eight home runs. Fuck. To beat the D-backs. 12 to 5. Sorry, Q QC. Uh, mm. Uh, mm. Sorry, buddy. Sorry, not sorry. All right, guys. Let us <laughs> in the comment section down below. Opening day was a success. It was awesome. For him, not me. See y'all later. <laughs>